All right, guys, so welcome back to another video. Today, we are on our way to San Francisco. We're really excited. I had to wake up a little early this morning to kind of make good timing, but um, plan is just to get there for tomorrow for a really, really special event that we're extremely excited for. Um, we're going to be filming an engaged episode with Hyundai and meeting up with the NorCal uh, end community. So it's just going to be really, really fun to get out, meet new people, see how the end community is out there, and to enjoy our drive together. So got Emily right here. She's putting gas in. Just filled up the Veloster. About to go to Starbucks and then we're gonna continue making our way down. It's about a six and a half hour drive, so taking our time taking PCH and uh, we're just gonna see how it is. So we made it to our first pit stop. We had to use the restroom, so we just came to a Vons like in Ojai somewhere. I don't know if Henry mentioned what we're doing exactly. Some of you may know and some of you may not know. Those who follow me on Instagram do know that uh, I was chosen this year to be an influencer through Hyundai Ends um, like worldwide on Instagram. This is like maybe the second or third year that they've done this. I wasn't aware from the very beginning that this was even a thing that Hyundai and Division did. And I think that's so awesome that Hyundai does these type of things where they include like the end owners. Yeah, I'm really excited. Tomorrow is pretty much the day that we are going to be doing filming with Hyundai up in NorCal. I'm kind of showing more about the community uh, as far as the end community goes. And I don't see any other car companies doing this type of thing with their car owners so I, it should be a lot of fun just to get out experience something new we will um, continue our drive and we'll keep you guys updated along the way So here we are, we finally made it to a little stopping point at Elephant Seal Vista Point, which was a really cool spot for us to stop at. We've never seen any elephant seals in the wild like this, you know, and in SoCal, we don't have really any areas to view anything like that near us. So it was really cool to see this and we definitely had to stop. So good morning guys, it's around 5, 10 a.m. I'm getting ready, I'm always in the room right now. I'm about to go downstairs real quick and just start wiping down the cars. Um, we weren't expecting for the drive to take so long yesterday. Um, we we're expecting for the drive to be around like six and a half hours, but we ended up taking PCH and that actually ended up causing for us to, it actually took almost close to 10 to 11 hours for us to drive all the way up from LA to San Fran. So really good drive, but it was just tiring. We didn't get here to like around 7.30. Um, so we didn't really, we had to go and wash the cars last night, so we didn't wash them this morning. So just gonna kind of just do the little last minute touches um, and see how the cars are. So here we are in the parking garage. The cars are right where we left them. So just gonna do some last minute touches and then get ready to leave at six and we're gonna meet with the production crew and start the day. So extremely excited. The day is finally here. All right guys, so first stop, we're here at gas station, just filling up with gas. Uh, we barely made it to the hotel with like 30 miles left. So we're here with the production team right now. We're with some of the people from Hyundai right now. I'm not sure if they're the production team, but very nice people. All right, guys, good morning. It is 
Sunday and it's 6.45 in the morning. I don't think I ever told you, but pretty much we're uh, going to meet up with NorCal End Club who's on Instagram and uh, have a whole cruise. Pretty much it's going to be pretty exciting. I can't wait to see the whole day of what it brings and uh, yeah, this is just great for our end community, I feel like. We're going to finally show um, just, you know, how much love the Hyundai owners have for their end cars. So. I think it's really exciting for all of us. We're following um, in the van in front of Henry is the Hyundai team. So they've been so nice, so courteous um, to us and I'm excited to work with them all day. It's always great being in a good company. So yeah, I'm excited, nervous, but excited and we'll, we'll take you guys uh, along with us. All right, guys. So we just met with the production crew for Hyundai and Worldwide, and we're gonna go and do the first scene where Emily's picking up uh, David, which is hitch hitchhiking from uh, that dude in blue. So really excited to go ahead and uh, be behind the scenes and just see everything. Really ex proud of Emily for just doing this and uh, you know not being so out of in, in her comfort zone. Not, if not many people know Emily, she is kind of a shy person and it is kind of hard for her to get on camera and stuff like that. So just really proud of her and uh, really excited for this experience and to see how everything turns out. for Emily. She just left to go film the first segment of the episode of Engage with Hyundai. So I'm just chilling, waiting, did a little photo shoot of the car. Um, we parked really nice to a really cool area. We're really high up next to the to the beach. So I'm gonna, I'll post a video of what it looks like, but it's really, really beautiful where they had us parked. So just chilling, waiting, and when she comes, we'll continue on down and meet up with the rest of the NorCal N Club and uh, continue on the cruise. So we're really excited and yeah. stop that's where we pretty much shot the first scene of the guy David uh, he's hitchhiking he's the host very down-to-earth guy really cool so it just made everything uh, easier to do it was nerve-wracking but the, my line was super easy we changed one uh, theme beforehand now we're going to uh, the first stop which is in Santa Cruz we're gonna go to a coffee place, a coffee shop, get some coffee, and then cruise out with everybody and start our day. I'll have Henry record as much as he can. I'll make sure that uh, he kind of is my little cameraman today and tries to follow us around as much as possible. Um, they're legit. They have like a whole production team. So, you know, there's cameras recording and um, mics, you know, they even have me mic'd up. I don't know if they can hear me right now. 
right now, but <laughs> maybe they can, I'm not sure. But yeah, uh, very, very fun. Hey guys, so real quick, welcome back. Just wanna go ahead and say that we're here at NorCal. All right guys, so we have the production crew and David from That Dude in Blue getting in with Emily in the car. We're all getting ready to pretty much go out and start the crew. So really super excited to go out. Super, super excited. We have Kevin over there at the home. Super excited guys, this is really cool. The NorCal Ant community has been really welcoming. Very, very nice ends out here. Uh, we, there's somebody that actually came out from uh, Nevada. We have somebody from Oregon. So a lot of dedication and it's really just cool to see the community come together. And uh, yes, love it. Homie Kevin's about to pull up next to me right now. Let me get him on here. What up Kevin? Love his performance of Blue Veloster and it's got the little ones in the back right there. Hi, you guys ready? Kevin's from San Luis Obispo and he comes up to a lot of our events out in SoCal. So that's how I first got to know him. So which is really cool. That's one thing I really like about getting out to go to new places. You get to really meet people that you know on Instagram or online and you see them in person and you actually get to know them. So it's really cool. And I'm really appreciative of the fact that we're here. So just wanted to follow up. We're still here cruising around. Have a Kona N in front of me. So badass to see it in front of me. I mean, I've seen a, you know quite a few in person still, but I mean, it, it's still so really cool to see it. They sound really nice. He's, he's dipping. But yeah, having fun, enjoying the nice view. Got Martin right there, talking to everybody, making sure everybody's doing everything right. Uh, going, What's going on, Martin? Camera, how's it going, man? Good, yeah, man. Uh, looking good. Hopefully, we got enough space. Yeah. All right, guys. So we finished parking the cars, and we have the whole community right behind us. It's actually really badass to see everybody here parked. Emily has her her car parked off to the side right now, but. I'm gonna go ahead and just start showing you guys everybody here and then I'll go ahead and continue the video once I go ahead and get back. So I think Emily is about to start asking questions to the community right now and start giving away some prizes. So we'll see how that goes. I know she's probably pretty nervous because there's a lot of people watching, but she's going to have to get over it and figure it out. So we'll see how she does and see what they end up with. All right, guys. So Emily's back in the car with her bad and jacket. What the heck? I, I want know. it. I wish I could keep it. Oh. Let's just take it and run with it right uh, now. Let's just go. Let's I'm go back home. I'm excited to swear it for the interview, but it was exciting. It was nerve wracking. The whole group of all the N Club people were behind us. <laughs> so they were watching me and David do our part. And that I was had... even more like suspenseful and like, oh my gosh, you know? 
but um, it was good. I think it was successful. They got the parts that they needed, and luckily, the whole production team is so friendly, so nice, it makes me feel so welcomed. So that kind of makes it more easy, you know, more relaxed. Um, but just being in front of a camera is like literally scary. Like right now. Well, yeah, no, but you know, like no, yeah. Heck, there was a lot of people. It, there was a lot YouTube, of people. They're gonna YouTube. see because I had recorded right before, so they. And then, see. like when it's me and you, it's just us, so it's not like a whole group of people or like it's not scripted. So, yeah. But I'm proud of you. It's a fun experience for sure. Thank you, baby. Alright guys, so we're at another stopping point right now with the end community and this is at Pescadero Beach, I believe it's called. Um, I should have recorded it at our last point, we're at a pretty badass little lighthouse place. But we're here and there wasn't enough parking for everybody to park in this little area. So we have everybody else parking right back over here. So we're going to go ahead and make a walk down that way and see how it's turning out. Got that dude in blue schooling some people real quick on what Hyundai ends are, wondering what's going on. And the gentleman already knew what the Nurburgring was, so he was like, oh yeah, I know exactly what these cars are capable of doing. Extremely cool. Did you see that there's those roller coasters that we saw? Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, but so we're here and we're doing a photo shoot pretty much. Um, while well, Hyundai is doing a photo shoot of the Elantra. So we're pretty much getting some drone shots. I'm gonna get some photos of me with the car and then just the car by itself. Um, that way Hyundai and Worldwide could post it on their Instagram. And then um, once they post it, um, I'll be able to post it on my you know, Instagram and my socials and stuff like that, so. I'm sitting in the car right now while we're taking pictures right here of Emily. 
some of the guys right there. He's gonna put like some stuff on the glass to show you. You can kind of see where she's standing in the mirror. I have to hold my foot on the brake <laughs> to show the tail light. Exciting for her. Really cool moment. It's been a really cool experience interacting with uh, Hyundai Korea and uh, Hyundai and Worldwide and just uh, being able to give feedback on the on the product that we have on what they feel like can be improved it's a once in a lifetime opportunity for sure to be able to uh, talk and voice your opinion to people like that and uh, I really didn't hold back <clears throat> so I let them know please make a coop no <laughs> All of that and then today we did um, a photo shoot with Hyundai as I'm sure you guys saw uh, so that that was really fun it was really interesting like this whole uh, and I'm driving right now by the way but I found a way to safely hold the phone without me having to hold it so um, yeah it was really fun I had so much fun because it was successful you know we all got the content that was needed and now all Hyundai has to do, obviously, is put the video together, put, um, you know, the, the photos obviously have to be edited, all that. So we probably won't really be able to show this vlog until right now when you guys are seeing it. Tomorrow, me and Henry go to work, so, but we're off on Wednesday because on Wednesday, we get to go get my car wrapped. Woo! So I'm so excited. Um, I'm not excited to leave it because obviously like who likes to do that to their car, but yeah, I just, uh, I had such a great time. I don't want to make this outro any longer, but I had a great time. Monday and Worldwide was amazing to work with. I would have never thought that I would even have an opportunity like this, me recording with them, doing a photo shoot with them. Like it was a lot of fun. Yeah, it's totally worth the exhaustion um, because, again, this is just an amazing opportunity and I'm very grateful and I still can't even believe it. I felt so bougie because they were like, do you need anything? Do you need water? Do you need coffee? Like, do you need to eat something? Like, are you good? You know, um, if it was the sun was like beaming down for too long. You know, they would come with their sweater and kind of like um, make shade and stuff like that. So it was just so sweet of them to even be still considerate. I'm glad to meet the whole team because again, everyone was was great. Like literally zero complaints. They they were they went above and beyond. And before I go, I do want to give a quick little shout out to my husband Henry, just for all his patience for just everything I mean he was waiting on us so much for uh, you know like the whole production the whole recording scenes like he was so patient um, he obviously got really great footage and behind the scenes for you guys so it was really great and I know that he had a lot of fun um, going you know with the cruise like driving his own car so I'm really happy that at least he, he got to enjoy it in that aspect you know but yeah, to be honest, without Henry, um, I don't even think I personally would be into cars as, as much as I like them. Um, I will say he's the brains when it comes to anything car related. So if you guys do have questions, reach out to him, ask him, you know, questions regarding either the Gloucester or the Launcher, even the Genesis, um, like the Hyundai Genesis, he's very uh, knowledgeable in these cars and he does a lot of research and you know he might not know everything but uh what he does know he's more than happy to share with you guys thank you guys so much for watching today's little vlog behind the scenes we hope you guys enjoyed it and um don't forget to like 
the video. Uh, comment something below, something that you love about your hunting and or hunting um, in general, just as a brand. And we hope that you guys enjoyed it, and we will catch you all on the next one. Bye.